welcome to The Good Ride. My name is Steph and we're here looking at the 686 Black Magic Bib in a size small. Thank you to Gravity Sports up at Mount Bachelor for letting us test this out today. Uh, so here is a look at the bib in a size small. Uh, this bib has a 10K breathability rating with a 10K waterproof rating. Um, it has 40 grams of insulation in the seat and in the knees. So let's check out some of the features. Uh, it has pretty uh, wide straps. They're not super flexible straps here um, with the adjustability here. So pretty easy to adjust though. You just pull it up or pull it down. It's not like your normal cinch adjustment. It's just kind of a one finger thing. And they do have these stretch panels at the back that's hooked up to the middle there. Um, so a little stretchy, but not overall stretchy for the entire strap. This could improve the longevity of the strap so it doesn't get stretched out at all. But yeah, pretty comfortable unless you, this adjustment ends up on the top of your kind of collarbone. It might be a little uncomfortable, but um, pretty low profile for as far as the hardware on the bibs go. So let's check out some of the pockets. We have this big front pocket here uh, with a Velcro closure. Um, and it's pretty big. It's this whole panel right there. Um, and then here, I'm assuming this is the phone pocket, it has a Velcro closure there. Maybe, I don't really actually know. There's no way my phone's fitting in there. Yeah, so not a phone pocket if you have a large phone. Um, maybe a snack pocket, maybe a pass pocket. But it goes into here. Uh, entry's not big enough for me to fit my hand in, at least. Um, there are belt loops that go around all the way here. And then here we have stretchy side panel. Just add a tiny bit of stretch there. There are two back pockets with Velcro. Velcro there, Velcro there. Not the easiest to get into. There we go. And then two zipper hand pockets here. And the zippers don't look waterproof, so they're just zippered hand pockets. Uh, this one has a key ring on it. And um, it has felt lining on the front and like a, like just the normal pant lining on the back. But it is kind of weird because there's like, it's kind of hard to explain, but there's like this, uh, squeaky feel between the two materials. So we have the pant material, but then on the inside of the pant is like a felt material and they rub and it kind of creates a little bit of some weird texture there. This is just a weird personal thing, but um, those are the pockets. Uh, no pockets on the legs at all. So just here, here, and then the two back pockets. There are zipper vents, kind of fairly small vents with some mesh on the inside. And then going down to the bottom here, there is a reinforcement hem. So this is pretty strong hem here on the bottom. And then you get a gator here. And there is one kind of an extra panel there if you want to get it a little bigger. On the sides, there's no entry, no, no zipper down this side. So it'd be just here. Not really a drop seat. So probably will cause a little bit of some issues if you're going to the restroom at all. But you can see on the inside, it's felty material on the inside here. So it's pretty soft on the inside. But as far as fit and feel goes, you know, it's kind of a regular fit, semi baggy, um, but I'd say it does pretty true to fit as far as the size small. It's not extremely long either. So as far as the height goes, I think that does fit me for my height. Pretty simple bib, um, nothing over the top as far as tech wise goes. Has average waterproofing and breathability. So more of a bib for your average resort days uh, where you're not gonna be seeing a ton of weather. That is a look at the Black Magic insulated bib from 686 in a size small.